Hi YouTube! So today's video is going to be a little different. Hi, I'm Gabrielle, Michelle's daughter. She's recently gotten me in the spirit with all of her fall decorating, so I decided to create a fall slash Halloween vignette for my apartment. I'm going to show you how I put it together and how I made five easy and inexpensive DIY decorations. For this vignette, I started with my childhood desk that I'm using as a table. In the room, I already use a lot of grays, purple, and turquoise as an accent color. And a lot of my furniture is black, so I set up this trunk and these boxes I already had to match. I then added these mirrors and lanterns. The black not only contrasts nice with the purple, but of course they're both Halloween colors. Next, I brought in some orange with the witch's hat, leaves, and a pumpkin along with more turquoise items. Now for the DIY projects. For the first DIY, I used these mason jars I already had. I purchased these specifically for projects, but you can use anything you have at home or they even sell them at Dollar Tree. I simply painted them purple, don't be too concerned with your brush strokes, and drew jack-o'-lantern faces on them with the marker. Candles are a perfect way to change the mood of a room. I already had some, including this brown nature wig, one that is perfect for fall because it has a wooden wick that crackles as it burns. And this orange candle was only a dollar at the Dollar Tree. Though inexpensive and small, it smells great. And simply adding burlap bows to candles that you aren't necessarily burning is another cute way to spruce up for fall. For this next project, I transformed this winter wreath into a fall one by covering it with earth. Then I added orange mesh and leaves from Dollar Tree. The next DIY is very easy. Mom sent me this picture of some pumpkins she saw on Etsy. They look similar to some leftover fabric I had, so I used that fabric to cover a wall of toilet paper and create a pumpkin. Lastly, I used this twine I bought at the Dollar Tree and paper I bought on the Dollar Isle at Target to make a banner. I drew the triangles, cut them out, and attached them to the twine. Here's what the entire vignette looked like when I finished.
Thanks so much for watching this video. Be sure to subscribe and watch mom's other videos. Remember, part two of the fall vignette series will be up soon.